Hi guys, welcome to LES Matters TV. On this channel, we focus on everything early childhood related. If these are the kind of videos you're looking for, what do you have to do? Subscribe and not just subscribe, turn on that notification bell so whenever a new video is being dropped on this channel, you'll be the first person to be notified. It helps in terms of a child's cultural development. For those of you that have been following me on this channel, for the past few weeks have been looking at holistic child development, how play up in terms of a child's holistic development. I looked at the physical, intellectual or cognitive, language, emotional, social, spiritual. So I'm going to leave the video up, up here and down below so that you can keep up to date in relation to what holistic development is and how play up in terms of a child's holistic development. Today is all about cultural development, yes. As you know, in the area of early childhood, play is a child's work. The children are playing, but at the same time, they are learning. And this is what play is all about. They are playing, they are having fun, but at the same time, they are learning. And you need to understand that through play, children learn a lot. It comes naturally to them as they are playing, they are exploring, they are finding out about things. And this helps in terms of their development. So today is all about cultural development. So how does play helps in terms of a cultural development? For instance, as an early childhood educator in your classroom, if you have materials that relates to culture, so what the children does is when they are playing, they explore these materials and by so doing, they have an awareness of culture. For instance, in the book corner, if you have books relation to culture, you know, when the children go over to the book corner, they pick this book, they explore, they look at the pictures and then they have a general understanding of what culture is. You're helping them to raise cultural awareness so the children pick this book you know it's early childhood it's picture books they look at it they flip the pages it's helping them in terms of what is this book all about they're looking at the picture and it has to do with their imagination as well a lot is going on through their brain what does this picture look like what is this picture telling me so you're helping them you're creating cultural awareness also for instance in the own corner as well if you have dolls that represent different culture, dolls that are dressed in different background. So when the children are playing with this doll, you're helping them, you're creating cultural awareness because they're exploring. They look at this doll, for instance. This doll doesn't look like me. How come this door is different? You know, they look at it and you know, you're raising cultural awareness to understand that yes, I'm not the only person. Some people don't like me and this is normal. So can you now see that in the corner, you have doors, you know, you even have dresses of different culture, of different background and the children can wear them. When they wear them, they explore, they look at it. Oh, this is different. And then they get a general understanding of what culture is all about. So you're helping them to create cultural awareness. You're doing this true play. It comes naturally to the children. True play, they're exploring what's going on around them. So when you have materials, have different materials, diverse materials that represent different culture that the children can explore, they pick it up, they look at it, like, okay, what is this? What does this look like? And you're helping them to generate cultural awareness. And you need to understand that this starts from early childhood. Like the saying, catch them young. You want the children to know more about culture. You do this true play materials that you provide they're exploring with the room layout you could also have pictures as well visuals 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 really up in relation to early childhood you know you we're talking about early childhood in the context of ireland it's children from back to six in the states and other countries children from back to eight so pictures visuals tells a lot the children look at the picture and it sends a signal to them. So in your classroom, as well as an early childhood educator, you could have pictures, you know, that depict, you could have pictures, you could have photos that depict people from different backgrounds. So when the children come in into the setting, they look around, they look around, they see these pictures and them to create cultural awareness. Another way you could also do this is true story sharing. Yes. You know young children love stories. They love listening to stories. So you could get books about different culture, read it to the children, ask them questions. And then they start to ask you questions as well. Okay, how come this person is different? And you'll be able to extend on their knowledge, build on their knowledge, to let them know that different culture exists and let them know that this is what diversity is all about. We're different and we need to appreciate and value our differences. I hope you've taken note of the points that I've listed in relation to how play ups in terms of a child's cultural development. And if you want more of this on this channel, what do you have to do? Subscribe and not just subscribe. 
turn on that notification bell so that whenever a new video is being dropped on this channel, you'll be the first person to be notified. Until I come your way next time, stay safe and mind yourselves for now. Bye.